So, set us up who are Stig and Bobby in this movie. I'm Stig. I'm He's Bobby. Bobby. And we're in this movie. Yes. What's the relationship between these guys? Uh, pretty tumultuous in the beginning. In the say? beginning, yes. I don't like him. He tries to like me. I don't want him to like me. He wants to be my people. I don't want people. But by the end, I, I'm peopled. So we're both basically undercover, and we're trying to play each other, but ultimately we're forced to uh, help each other, even though we are reluctant to do that because everybody else is after us. And because wants to kill the us. man is yes. manipulating us, as the man often does. Yes. The movie relies heavily on the chemistry between you two, and it comes across awesome in the movie. What was it like working together? That's all CGI. Yes. <laughs> We actually hated each other. We yeah. don't like each other We're now. It's a CGI it's and some CGI. chemistry, which is a rare thing. It was created by ILM, mm -hmm. and we were the first ones to use it. So we do mm -hmm. have that going for us this summer to compete with all those other effects-driven movies. Mm -hmm. We have the first. We weren't movie even there. To, it was two green uh, screens. Interject uh, film chemistry. Mm -hmm. It was like when you do. And well, now we're converted to 3D chemistry. Mm -hmm. So watch that shit come at you. <laughs> It's like when you do an animated movie and your VO booths are in separate, mm -hmm. separate No, it's days. not like that at all. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You like it. So, um, set up the storyline of this movie. What's no, it about? No, we don't have to. We, we, you know. Please? All right. Well, there's this pot-smoking teddy bear. <laughs> he introduced us at a party, right? I'm not a teddy bear, man. I, I no, not you. you. He introduced us. No, uh, basically, when you meet our characters, we are together and we're about to rob a bank, which I think we're going to rob this bank because we're going to be able to use this money, stealing money from the drug cartels, to fight the drug cartels. So now you notice right off the bat, my character is not very intelligent. He's pretty gullible, and believes this story from his his, his superior officers. That he's going to rob this bank to use the money, rob the bank, which held, holds money from the drug cartels, and he's going to use that money to fight the drug cartels because he really doesn't like the drug cartels because they're doing bad stuff. And then what? What about you? I don't know, man. Exactly. I, I'm just there with that that guy. So that's what happens. Mm -hmm. And then basically, everybody's after us. And we're like, holy shit, we got to get out of here. Mm -hmm. And he's like, no, don't go that way because there's other people over there that are going to chase us. So we're like, fuck that. Let's not go there. Let's go over here. Right. And, and then we, we end up at his girlfriend's it. house. And, and I'm like, I thought I was going to have her as my girlfriend. Right. So we have that conflict. There's a lot of conflicts, a lot of twists and turns. Why should audiences see this movie? Why not? <laughs> No, All the other movies this year suck. Yeah. Oh, right? Let's get a good one in oh. there. With some crazy wild guys. Oh, you know what it is? It's a great balance of action, drama, and comedy. And it fuses those three things seamlessly. And you get to see Denzel Washington in his first, I'd say, more broad comedic role. He's had comedic elements of performances that he's done in the past. He's certainly made people laugh. But in this one, he's going to make you laugh until you cry and then pee your pants. And you're not going to get up to go pee because you don't want to miss the next thing that Denzel's Well, because you will have already peed. So you, you just won't have to get up. set in it. And mm. the movie's an hour and 40, so by the time you pee the first time, you're dry when you get up. That's it. And go home. So you that's don't even why go home I to change. That's you go to the restaurant with some random people that you met in the theater to discuss how great the movie was. But if was. you do need to go home to change, Mark is opening a new chain of underwear dry line. cleaners and underwear <laughs> yes. sales. Perfect. Thank you.